good morning. The mother goddess is shining on me today. Um, I am not a coupon guru and we all know who that those coupon gurus are. Okay. We know who will break down the sales for you and will make, make your couponing much easier. I am a couponer and I do very well for my household very well. Okay. Um, but I have a new subscriber and they asked me if I would do a video about how to coupon and how to use coupons. I'm probably not the best person in the world because I am the most unorganized couponer that you've ever seen in your entire life, but it works. Now, this is something that they texted me. One thing about coupons, often they're for crap. That's bad for you women. First of all, had I been able to reach through my phone, I would have probably grabbed hold of their neck and strangled them. Because I'm going to tell you, manufacturers put out coupons for the products. Okay. Now, in the beginning of the year, people make their, their resolutions. I'm going to eat healthier. I'm going to lose weight. I'm going to be a healthy, fit person through the year. So that's when you're going to find the coupons for the protein bars, the diet food. Um, you're going to find product uh, coupons for granola bars, healthy cereals, oatmeal. You're going to find the better sales for those products as well. And when you shop your coupons, and if you are a couponer and you know that these sales come and they rotate through, you know how to use your coupons. So say in December, I get a coupon for um, Cascadian cereal. It's a natural cereal, okay? I know as a couponer that I'm going to hold that coupon till mid-January because that coupon's probably good for, I don't know, eight to six weeks mostly. And I'm gonna know that by the end of that cycle, there's going to be healthy food coming on after the first of the year. That's one of the keys. Okay. I know that when grilling season happens, like the, uh, what, the past three weeks, I have stocked up on seasonings, Weber seasonings, McCormick seasonings, French's mustard. God knows I got a plenty of mustards, but you got to watch and you got to save those coupons for those sales. So you know that when you get ready to start doing your grill out right before July 4th, you know that back the mid June to now, you should have already used those coupons for your spices. I am stocked up on McCormick's and Weber spices, French's mustard, Heinz ketchup, mayonnaise, now, I don't buy a whole lot of mayonnaise because we don't really use a whole lot of mayonnaise, but I could have a whole stockpile full of it at this time for very little cheap, for a very little bit, very cheap. But since we don't use a lot of mayonnaise or Miracle Whip, we don't use Miracle Whip at all. I just think it's disgusting. That's just me because I don't like that. But anyway, now as we head into fall, we know that into winter time we're going to be starting to get like chunky uh s chunky soups coupons and then we know that the stores are going to start putting them on sale like what was it it was um november december when the chunky style campbell soups went on sale for 99 cents and there was a coupon for a dollar off of three well guess what i bought three and got one free and I only spent, what, $1.98, $1.97. It's just, you have to understand that the manufacturers and the stores are going to make those products seasonal. Okay, so like I said, your healthier coupons are going to be in the beginning of the year because when they, they start making those January 1st, um, oh, I'm going to eat healthier. I'm going to tell you, that's when you're going to need to stock up on your granola bars, your protein bars, your health drinks, and all of that stuff is going to come on sale. Okay, and then you go into spring and you're going to start getting 
other things like your fruit cups, your um, your Dole and Del Monte fruit cups. Kroger's will have theirs on sale. Okay, so you hold those coupons till they rotate into the sales. That is the key to couponing and to know what products are going to come through. Now this week, I'm pretty excited because number one, pasta. Okay, I haven't seen a pasta deal. It's been about three months since I've gotten pasta for $49.50 a box. Guess what? This week, there's three different brands. One brand is an extremely healthy brand. Okay, there's a five times digital which makes it, I think, 50 cents a box or 49 cents a box. It is made from vegetable matter. I think it's called Ronzoni, Ronzoni, whatever. That's the one that's very healthy. I get it. That's what we use for spaghetti. I thought my husband would buck me on it. He don't care. Just put something on it. He's going to eat it. He don't care if it's made out of vegetables or wheat or whatever. So I am going to stock up on all three brands of pasta this week. I think it's um, Cremet, the Ronzoni, and I'm, I'm, I'm not sure, but it might be the Barilla. There's a five times digital that makes it 50 cents a box. You know? So that's what I'm going to do. Okay, Mother Goddess, we have shined enough. Maybe not. Let's see if I can move this a little bit. I really didn't have a whole lot. But anywho, um, so right now, we've got the five times digital. I don't know that I have any pasta coupons, but Sunday's coming. That's like Sunday, I'm going to get free Tide, and I don't know how close the Downey's going to be to free, or 99 cents, or bounce, but there's going to be some Procter & Gamble coupons that are going to give me some free products Sunday. Let me tell you, I don't eat Tide, but I wash my clothes in it. You know why? because they have a, co a cold water formula. I wash my clothes in cold water. If Tide is free and I have the cold water type, you better believe I'm gonna be buying it. And I'll probably get five newspapers, two, four, six, eight, ten dollars worth of newspapers. And here's why, because the sales are gonna be so good that I'm gonna make my ten dollars back really quickly. What is a bottle of Tide normally? Well, they're going to have it on sale for $2.99, but what is it normally? Now, I have to go, but I just wanted to let you know, there are people out there who think that couponing is just crap. And to you, I have to say, follow the sales, hold your coupons, and know the seasonal sales. Because like I said, if you want to buy your health food and stock up, get your coupons in December, and in January and through February, you're going to find them healthier foods. If you coupon at Kroger a lot, they will start sending you coupons. And then you can get your produce coupons, you can get your meat coupons, seafood coupons, tons of that. Just know there are good products on coupons. There's health, um, personal care products and coupons, your cleaning and laundry coupons, pet food coupons. It's not just about getting a bag of chips or getting some crap because we really don't eat crap at my house. I buy crap to snack on. I buy crap to throw into the bins in case of an emergency. Other than that, we don't buy crap. And there's some healthy cereals, the Honey Bunches of Oats. I got two boxes of that last week for 99 cents because I had a dollar off two coupon and they were 99 cents a piece on that Saturday sale. So there you go. There are healthy things. And to that subscriber, I say, text me later <laughs> if you want to. But um, I'm not a coupon teacher, but I'm going to give you three sources for Kroger, um, Ohio Valley Couponer, awesome. For Dollar General, couponing at its finest. She's fantastic. She writes it on paper. She shows you the steps to get in those sales. And then couponing with Tony for CVS. And I'm gonna start watching Tony again a little more in depth because I got a new customer that wants makeup from me. So here we go. Um, lots of coupons out there. It's not just for crap food. 
you just have to know what's seasonal and what manufacturers, when they want to sell their products and when the store wants them to go on sale. So you have a great day, everyone. And oh my God, my neck is stiff. <laughs> Bye, y'all.